Protect yourself. This isn't for the faint of heart. Hey guys, welcome to Jamaru 16. I am your host Javon, and today we're about for a brand new benchmark. Today we're testing out Stray for the PC. Today I'm running this on my Intel Core i3 7100U with the Intel HD 620 integrated graphics. We're running with 16 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM in dual channel memory mode, and I am using a low-end config to get the game to be playable on this setup. As you can see, we are running at 960 by 540 at 20% resolution. Everything else is this on the lowest settings. And by oh by, pain has become a reality. I will leave a link in the description below to for you guys to copy and paste the files into uh, your system to get it playable like this. Yes, I did a previous video exactly showing you exactly how and where you need to post it. So just go watch that video first and then you'll see this one right afterwards. But this is how we managed to get Stray running on integrated graphics guys. Stray apparently is extremely demanding. Not this area, but the next area afterwards is going to be extremely demanding. So. Integrated graphics struggles. Look, it's even struggling here, as you can see. It's not it's not all fun in games with this game, man. This game is rough. This game is not easy to run. I wish it was. I didn't do the config with the iris, but um I will show you guys how to do the Vulcan one for the iris as well if you guys are getting a different error. Um for some reason some of these don't work. For my AMD graphics, the brightness has it has a brightness glitch which makes the game extremely bright for some reason. Can't fix it. It works on integrated graphics, so I don't know if that's an AMD issue or what. I will try to fix that. On integrated graphics, man, issues all around with this damn game. Nonetheless, it is performing here. Until it fades to black and then we, we run into real pain. Now, the i3 is nothing to sniff home about. It got 2.4 gigahertz. Giga it's a bottleneck most of the time. It's not right now, which is great. But it, I, I imagine it will because this game is very GPU dependent. Um, we'll see what app. Well, I guess it won't because it is GPU dependent. I guess it won't, huh? I guess it won't. <laughs> oh, never mind. I, I fooled myself. It is. It'll get back up there. Don't mind it. And as you can see, look what happened. So the game went down and all of a sudden, we're at 19 FPS. Not great. So imagine if I didn't put in the config, we'd be at 10, probably less. The game can get extremely demanding. I will try other tweaks in case, so stick around and hit that subscribe button in case you want to see the other tweaks I will put out to try to get this game to run at even lower end hardware. You know, I want to see if I can make it run lower than this, but yeah, it's going to be a wild ride. Look at this man, it's using 8GB of RAM too, so you need over 8 for integrated graphics, yikes. It's just this area, man. The game, it, it fools you into believing otherwise. At the last minute, the graphics updated, you know, for what it was required to run this with. I see why now. Because it's like, damn, this is a bit too demanding for that type of crap, bro. Integrated graphics can't run this properly. Um, I'm going to try to do something else that's not resolution based. Because, uh, let's see if we can get some settings lower. Because I don't know, man. Textures lower, I don't know, but we'll try something. But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and stick around for more epic content. Don't forget that notification bell so that you guys are alerted whenever I post a video on the channel. I post multiple videos all day about a wide array of hardware and emulation as well. There might be something you're interested in. Here we are playing Stray. I can't see anything, but I'm playing Stray. I mean, deal with it, right? We're getting about 19 FPS. That's not bad, to be honest with you. I can't see anything, but like I said, I could carry back up the res if I wanted to. I'm not going to do that, but I could. I mean, I, I probably will at the end of the video, just to show you guys. But look, it runs. The game is running on integrated graphics. I always like to pride myself on being the first to show you guys. Integrated graphics can run these new games, uh, just not well. <laughs> They can run them, but just not well. <laughs> I say they can run, I never said they would run great. They do they certainly don't. They certainly do not. But this isn't the worst experience, trust me. I've I've had terrible experiences. This is actually quite serviceable, especially if I carried it up to thirty, it probably would have been better. But I thought, eh, for more performance, let's go. Like I said, this is very GPU dependent, so the more things you can do to lower the, the graphics processing part, 
it would make this run a lot better. Now, I want to see what would happen if I start playing in the a different area, like the robot area where all the robots are, but I don't know how long that'll take to get there, so... And I mean, this area enough is demanding as it is, so there's a lot of foliage. I wish I wonder if I can find some way to get to lower all that. That'd be that'd be great if I could. Like guys, come on! I got a lot of videos coming out for straight for straight a day, like ten of them. It's gonna be wild. This area here specifically, I always lose the frames in this area. I feel like there's something wrong with this area of the game, and it is compiling, but it's directly eleven. It's weird, but it is this area that seems to really hurt me. But yeah, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget, please leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. ka -chow. Observe what? Bro, I can't see a gosh darn thing. What am I observing? Oh, a full-blown cutscene. Oh, I hope that doesn't make me f I don't drop. I don't drop when I jump. No! Damn. And the cat just walks like, oh, sucks to be you, buh. Sucks to be you. Oh, they actually went for a full-on cinematic here. You can tell this because the game doesn't look like crap. <laughs> Very different from in-game. And we've gone over to 9 gigs. Oh, we've gone back now. I, I would like to think that this area would be better because we're in this small area. Yeah. And there's still a lot of stutters. Oh, I'm hurt. I'm hurt. Oh, no. The poor cat's hurt. Oh, well, of course he is after that big fall. Ten gigs of RAM. It's increasing. It's going up. They ain't playing out here. They're like, bro, we gonna hurt you with these this RAM usage. Unfortunately, there's no way to skip cutscenes from the bane of my existence. But you know, I will see you guys next time. I hope you guys enjoyed.